and Penny is a new addition to the cat adoption floor. While she is a very petite cat, she's actually an adult. She's not a kitten anymore. She's about one to two years old, we're estimating. Uh, she is gray and white. And Penny came um, to a house about three weeks ago um, as a stray. The family took her in, um, but they uh, realized that the other pets weren't really into uh, Penny living in the house. And so they were, you know, they wanted to do what was best for their existing pets, and they brought Penny here to us. Uh, now, to be fair, three weeks really isn't necessarily enough of an adjustment period for animals to get to know each other if they're not used to living with one another. And we don't know how the integration period was done. Um, during our adoption interviews, we talk about how to introduce a new cat or dog to your existing pets. Um, you want to start them off in a, a, a confined room and then work on, you know, slowly letting the animals engage with one another, making sure that they have outlets to be away from one another, making sure they're always supervised. Um, there's a lot of different things that you can do, feeding on either side of a door, doing scent swapping and sight swapping. There's a lot of things that you can do to um, help those interactions become more positive a little bit more quickly. Um, that being said, animals don't have to get along. Um, I use it, uh, the example of, you know, multiple children in a household. They don't always want to be friends and hang out. You know, they, they love each other, but they don't always want to spend time together. Sometimes they get angry with one another. As long as no one's hurting each other, then it's okay. Um, so that's kind of how I equate it. Um, but the, she has had experience with a variety of children of different ages. They say she's playful, energetic, friendly, calm, things that we have seen here in the shelter. Um, when I went to get her today, she was sitting up in her little hammock. I started petting her. She liked that. She kind of showed me what she liked. And then when I pulled my hand away, she jumped right down um, to continue to get some pets. I picked her up, no issues there. She's been fine sitting here on Tammy's lap. So she's gonna be a um, pretty even keeled, well-rounded cat that should be a great addition to any family. You can visit her at 1832 Rosemont Avenue.